Hello everyone, welcome back to a new video. Today I'm going to be showing you how to create a ship command since it was requested by multiple uh, people from uh, like the Discord and comments on YouTube. So I'm going to be creating it uh, in this video. So without further ado, let's hop into the video. Alright, so we are here in the Visual Studio Code, our editor. So first of all, I'm gonna need to install Canvas, and that's pretty easy, npm i canvas. Alright, I already did it once, so I'm not gonna do it again. And I'm gonna go to my commands folder, fun, I'm gonna create a new one, call it uh, ship canvas. Alright, but yes. Let's put the command handler thing over here. And let's call it ship with two P's because uh, I already have one with one P. So uh, let's let's name it love anything, all right? So um, first, I'm going to, need to uh, define canvas with a capital C and then require uh, canvas, all right? So. First, let's do here canvas. All right, there's gonna be a uh, canvas here with a uh, uh, big C. Not create canvas. So we are now creating a canvas, and we put the dimensions 700 by 250. All right. And right now we want to get the context. So the context will be 2D. So uh, con ctx equal uh, canvas dot get context. 2D, alright. So now we want to get the pinked person, so I'm gonna do const target, alright, equal message dot mentions dot members or dot users dot first. Alright, perfect. So uh, if the target is basically me, so I don't want to ship myself. So if target.id is equal to message.author.id, we want to uh, return message.channel.send. Uh, please mention someone else. And I actually first need to check if there is actually a target or no. Alright, so I'm gonna do here return message.channel.send. Uh, please mention someone. Alright, so now after we got the target, alright, uh, I got here uh, in this channel. Alright, I got a background, alright, here. A heart and a broken heart. So uh, let me get the background link here. Copy link. So I want first do uh, the background. So const bg equal uh, await. Alright, because it's gonna take time. So await canvas dot load image. Alright, I'm gonna put the link over here. So now I want to do ctx the context dot draw image. Uh, it's gonna be basically the background uh, because I want to fill the canvas we create with the background, all right? So I'm gonna put it here zero zero and uh, canvas dot uh, width and canvas dot uh, height right here all right so actually if I try to do first first let me first here uh, create an attachment all right equal uh, new discord dot message attachment all right and let me set uh, actually let me do it here dot to buffer 
uh, let's name it uh, love.png all right so let me show you what will ha what will happen if i try to send it so message.channel.send image all right it should be now it should put the background we made we created here or we got it here uh this be so see this is the normal like how it normally look like so we're gonna stretch it and make it uh 700 by 20, uh, 250. So if I tried here, love. Uh, okay, I forgot to mention, just let me mention uh, my bot. All right. As you can see, uh, got a different shape now. So let's actually continue what we were doing. So uh, so now I want to uh, get the avatar. So const avatar equal uh, message dot author dot uh, display avatar display avatar URL and I want the format. Oops, here to be why am I? So uh, now I want to basically uh, load it, all right. So let me do. Let me actually put here. Let me put it in, in uh, inside of parentheses, all right. I'll let me put here canvas or await canvas dot load image directly instead of making two uh, variables. Let me just do it once right here. All right. So. Uh, let me just do it like this, more cleaner. So uh, now I want to actually draw the avatar. All right, so I'm gonna do ctx dot draw image. All right, and I'm gonna put it here as the avatar. And for sure, uh, I will put here the like the x and the y. And the heart and the width and all stuff. All right. So, so the first one is the X. So I'm gonna put here 100, and this 25, and 200 by 200. All right. So let's check how will this look now. It should have my avatar in it. All right. What is this? Oh, that's from the index. Never mind that. Uh, so here, if I tried it, I should have my avatar over here. As you can see, my avatar is over here. Perfect. That's what I want to do. So uh, now I want to uh, load the target avatar, the person that I mentioned. So const uh, target avatar equal await canvas dot load image and let me do a uh, target dot display avatar URL all right and let me uh, put here format let be PNG all right so I want to draw it all right so I'm gonna put here ctx dot draw image all right, and I want to put the target image, the thing what, that we want to draw actually, and then put the X so that is going to be 400, and then put uh, the Y that is going to be 25 as always, and uh, actually I need to put 200 by 200, that's sure, here and here. All right, so now it should show the my PFP here and the person, uh, the other person PFP over here. So let me now try it. Right. As you can see, put both PFP, both PFPs over here, as you can see here and here. So now I want to put hearts, but I, uh, I need to first make a random generated number. All right. 
but actually let me first load the images so uh, the heart and the broken heart so const uh, heart uh, let's put it as uh, canvas dot load image and let me put here the link and then const broken equal canvas dot load image all right let me get this one all right copy link all right also if you don't know how draw image works let me tell you here in a second so uh draw image uh, draw it here draw image uh, so look let me show you this is the syntax uh, how how is it how it will be the first the image and the x and the y and the width and the height and you can put more stuff here all right I'll be leaving the link for this in the description if you need it in any time all right so let me get the broken heart copy link show over here all right now I want to get a random generator number between 0 and 100 and that's pretty easy I'm going to just put const uh, random equal math dot flow all right and then I'll put math dot random and get 99 plus 1 here because uh oops I forgot to put this all right, so now I'm gonna get from one to one hundred, because normally if I remove this one, it's gonna be from zero to uh, nine hundred and nine. Uh, well, sorry, I mean ninety-nine. So now I want to say if random is bigger or equal to fifty, I want to do something. All right, so else I want to do something else okay so that's pretty easy now if it is 50 or equal to 50 I want to put a heart all right so I'm gonna put here ctx dot draw image I'm gonna put the heart and then I'm gonna put the heart at 275 and 60 and uh, 150 100 by 150 all right so uh, now after I do that I will want to make it an attachment so I'm gonna remove the attachment from here and put it over here all right and to make it actually look sick all right because I don't want to just give you some code I want you to make cool things so let's create an embed and it may equal new discord dot message embed right the set description is gonna be uh here let me let me get an emoji i forgot the name of it so twist twist is something yeah this shuffle basically all right here and then i'm gonna put here message dot author dot id dot username i mean plus mm, target dot username equal the random number we got all right percent i got to put percent here so now i want to dot attach all right attach files and I want to put the attachment here, so it's basically image. And I'm gonna set image, I'm gonna put here attachment, alright, attachment, oops, attachment, and then I'm gonna put here love.png, the name of it, love.png. Let me actually call this attachment, not image. All right, so uh, the set color I want to be green, and now I just want to return message the channel the send uh, embed. All right, let me put this attachment. I don't need this anymore. 
All right. So now I'm going to just copy this, the same. I'm going to put it over here. But I'm going to change hot to broken. All right. So let me just put here like broken and here. Actually, let's just keep both. So look. Here. Uh, I said if it is either more or equal to 50 it's gonna be uh, like heart So I'm gonna put I'm gonna draw the heart in a specific place here and I'm gonna buffer the Attachment the canvas. I mean and put it as some attachment and name it love PNG And then I'm gonna create an embed and put everything in it and just send it all right and here the scene So let me now just do no dot and let's test it out real quick so love my bot all tracks and uh, I got an editor at line 40 so what is wrong here let me check so image or canvas uh, expected so oh I know why I forgot to await those two all right. So should now work. All right. Another error. Oops, there's no error here. It works perfectly. I just had to await them. As you can see, it just says here my ball and this and I put the heart. As you can see, now I want to try to go again without heart. Let me put another bot here. Let me just get ready for another one. Okay, here. Let's just try again. As you can see here, uh, under 50%. Uh, I didn't get a match and I got a broken heart. Let's try it one more time. All right. And broken heart again. So that was it for today's video, I hope you enjoyed, don't forget to like and to subscribe and to leave a comment down below what you want the next video to be, that's it, and ciao!